now let's understand what are the other services being offered by GS1. So GS1 is an international organization, non-profit organization, helping governments to standardize the uh, the needs, governance needs, and making it unique. So, when, as I told you, the GTN is basically is for for the product. Similarly, GS1 is giving unique number for legal entities, rather the companies, which is called GCP. GS1 Global Company Prefix. Every company, every company is supposed to obtain a, a GCP, irrespective whether they 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 have barcode or not. So GCP, when GCP stands for as a legal entity, which physical location this company is located also is getting added to the GCP, which is called GLN, Geographical Location Number. For example, if your company is having the legal entity. GCP and your company is having an office in uh, in a particular geographical location for example in Dubai you will get a GLN number for that your office in Dubai and if you have a warehouse in Jabalali then you will get another GLN for that Jabalali warehouse you got it so GCP means it's for the company basically for the legal entity GLN means the geographical location associated with this company so your office your warehouse, if you have various outlets, each of the outlet, you will get a GLN number for that. You are supposed to obtain a GLN number for that. So, hope you are clear with GCP and GLN.